is the angel hug for Monday the 28th of October and um, last week a subject that sort of came up quite a lot at some point was the idea of how to raise our frequency, how to raise our vi vibration and not only for um, the purposes of raising the frequency of the planet but also for the to increase our potential to connect with the unseen realms to connect with our guides and the angels and also to raise our frequencies in order to raise our our expectations and our capacity for a better experience on earth so personally so what i want to look at today is how to raise our frequency but i'm going to use the atlantis cards to do that my lovely lovely um really they're my ultimate favorite because they are all about creating utopia they're all about remembering atlantis when it was one of the um, most ideal um civilizations ever before um it went a bit wrong <laughs> so this is what we refer back to in order to remember utopia and that's a really nice thing to keep in our frequency as we go through all of these changes that we're experiencing at the moment and i am feeling very aware of that dawning utopia at the moment despite some of the appearances because i'm seeing so many signs of it and i want to just reaffirm that today so monday um the cards is the card of creative expression so when i ask how can we raise our frequency? How can we embrace the feeling of heaven on earth? How can we improve our experience? And how can we connect more with higher beings? Creative expression seems like the perfect uh, card, the ideal way to do that. And um, the card says, uh, be individual. This is the main message. Your guidance is to do or make something creative. However you express this, you are called on to channel your divine energy into the unique, beautiful, harmonious and original. Take this opportunity to develop all your senses, create something unique and satisfying. So for Monday, to the answer to that question, how to raise our frequency, how to allow that higher frequency to take us through another week, um, the way that the weeks are organised at the moment, anyway, for a lot of people, Monday is the beginning of the week. Um, the highest expression, the highest experience of how to take that, take ourselves through a week in a very powerful way is to begin the week by being very, very creative. The card in terms of utopia and the bigger picture and what we're holding in our hearts as a higher frequency and how to reconnect with that in the collective sense. The message here says in the golden times, the Atlanteans loved to express their creativity through art, music and making beautiful things. They put their hearts and souls into their creations, knowing that the more they poured into them, the more love would radiate out from whatever they had fashioned. Although they had the power to manifest objects, they preferred to make them and derived great satisfaction from creating simple and unique pieces. And I want to talk a little bit about that because that really strikes a chord with me. Sorry about the musical pun, but it's very close to my heart. Um, so the reason I feel really, really drawn to um, explore that a bit more is we talk a lot about manifesting. We talk about manifesting a lot in, in the sense of creating the things we want, creating an experience that we want, creating a reality that we prefer to this one. However, if you imagine a civilization that was so evolved that manifestation was instant, it was immediate, and anything at all could have been created in that moment. Imagine those beings, however, choosing to create things with their hands, to make things, to experience themselves as creators in the tangible, real sense as we know it. And you really then have a sense of the essence of how we can include our bodies and our hearts and our souls in our creations and thereby raise the frequency of our bodies. So the energy combines within us. It all comes on board. Everything comes together to create something. And sometimes it's in that real simplicity of creating things with our hands, with our being, with our voices, you know, with our talents, that we really come to know that higher frequency. So Monday is going to be a day to really appreciate the simple, to appreciate our abilities and our talents that we can use right now, 
regardless of whether anything changes in our reality, our perceived reality, regardless of whether we have everything that we want, let's recognize today that we have everything that we need. We are everything that we need because we are creative beings and we are the creative expression of an even greater creative being. So have a great Monday just exploring creativity and the utopian concept of people being free to enjoy things that really are of the heart rather than to crave and aspire to things that are of the material. However, having said that, that isn't to say that it's wrong to want material things or to have desires or to have um, things that would enrich our experience. And also, it's not to say that things as they are, are fair and equal. That's not what I'm saying at all. But let's remember within all of these constructs that we still are extremely creative and able to enjoy satisfaction in the simplest of things. Okay, that's it for Monday, everyone. And I'll be back tomorrow. Thanks for listening.